All right, to the 2010 Dodge Journey Aftermath video. It, vi the video, at least of my run, not the whole derby, just my run, is up on the YouTube channel. So if you haven't seen it, go watch it. So here's what happened. Um, got a nice corner shot. Did a nice corner shot. Caved all that in. Subframe. I mean, you got, yeah, you got that little tweak right here. But for the most part, still relatively straight. Just seems spot welds. My bad, spot welds. Uh, ripped off. Kind of pretty much crushing this in. This, is, this used to be where the uh, spare tire, not the spare tire, but like the jack and stuff all sat so that crushed in real nice um the very very first hit i actually hit right here and then um after a green flag well after a red flag we had um went ahead and went backwards and then that's when the rest of this all happened Nothing really of note over here. Did get hit right there, but that was about it. So. That's coming in. This, oh, this piece right here, when this was actually out, this was actually pointed down. And had I left this, it probably would have ended up into my tire, but it did not. So. We're good. We're good. I am going to try and hit beat on this some more and get it to roll around. Um, as far as that goes, probably just going to leave it for now. Um, a little scrape, nothing major. Nice flat tire. I actually took a direct corner shot. The guy came in just like this. Bent, bent the bumper. And here's the damage. As you can see, that frame rail is not straight. You can even see in video the way I'm holding it right now, how bad it's actually bent. This frame rail is out a little bit. Not terrible, but come over this way. That doesn't. So, um, there's our plates. There, you can see right here where this cross member started to bend. And even when we got hit here in the corner, it shoved this back. And even though we welded a plate right here, let's try to get that out of the way. Welded a plate right here, it actually bent the plate inwards. So it'd be about what, a good half inch or so. Um, when he did that, it shoved the frame into. Uh, what, Oh, that's power steering. Looks like, yep, power, looks like power steering, pulley. All these lines are in the way. Broke that. Belt came off. Uh, surprisingly, the belt actually survived. Um, but yeah, broke belt tensioner, broke the power steering pump pulley. And I don't know, try to get down in here. And that is what is left of the motor mount. So, got some work to do. Um, ran good. Let me shut this hood. Maybe. Yeah, kind of ripped. Ripped the hood a good bit, but there. Because that hood is still relatively straight, and you can see how far in it actually smashed. Um, 
it was doing good. It was it was really good. It was really strong. Uh, made some really good, decent, a uh, couple decent hits, couple dog shit type hits, but at least my opinion. So that is basically the aftermath. It was not a very long run. I ended up hitting a guy, and there's emergency brake pedal and your brake pedal but there's no gas pedal none whatsoever so broke the gas pedal um it's only made of stupid plastic it should actually still be in here i just don't know where i threw it at right there it is Broke it. So, cheap plastic. But we think we may have a fix for that. So, this, um, it is wire. Uh, or electric throttle, whatever you want to call it. It's not the cable. Um, so, we're going to have to figure out something different. Um, but yeah, that, this is actually what took me out. It broke and I have no throttle. So, um, it is what it is, but we will rebuild and we will be running this thing again. So, yep. And it's an electric one. So, we will have to figure that one have to figure that out but it will run again it will see another round for sure just don't know if it will i doubt it will be this year it's already middle of september so um most of the derbies now are going to be about two two and a half hours away and i just i don't want to drive that far so not not right now anyways but there it is Unfortunately, not a lot of damage, but um, we're, we'll, we'll rebuild and see what happens for round two, guys. So, well, have a good one. Enjoy your guys' weekend. Bye.